I'm not seeking vengeance or justice. I, I, I just want to know what happened to my daughter. A local mother grasping for answers after a deputy involved shooting ends with her daughter's death. A key piece of evidence, her daughter's car. Investigators say the Boone County deputy fired four times at the windshield after the car hit him. Nine on your side working to cover every angle of this story since it broke overnight. Amy Wattis is live with what she's learned. Amy? Julie, officials here with the Boone County Sheriff's Office say they don't want to hurry this investigation. They're sifting through every piece of information that they have to determine if this shooting was in fact justified. She was upstairs putting her makeup on and um, I said, where are you going? And she said, she said, I'm not sure. I said, I might be going to a party. That was the last time Brandy Stewart spoke to her daughter, 19 year old Samantha Ramsey, on Friday night. My daughter was not a saint by any means, but she was a very good person and she would have never disrespected uh, an officer. I mean, she was raised better than that. Police say 28 year old Tyler Brockman, a deputy with the Boone County Sheriff's Office, was called to River Road in Hebron for an accident. That's when he came across a pedestrian walking along the road. Brockman was tipped off that there was a large field party going on along the Ohio River. People are leaving. He wants to stop, check sobriety, you know, that, that thing that we do, if you will. He, he goes to stop that car, and um, the driver accelerates and hits him. And, uh, you know, he, he's on the hood of the car, and he, in turn, shoots through the windshield. Witnesses say he fired four shots. Bobby Turner was one of three passengers in the car. Ramsey was the driver. I heard like a boom, like basically like a jump, jumping on the hood, basically. And I looked up a little bit, then started shooting. I didn't see him withdraw his gun. See how quick it was. Deputy Brockman was taken to the hospital for leg injuries. Ramsey was pronounced dead at St. Elizabeth in Florence. While officials say Ramsey doesn't have a record in Boone County, she does in Kenton County. Sunday marks a year since she was arrested for driving a car under the influence. I won't let my daughter's death be in vain. And I won't stop until I have answers. Now, Samantha wanted to be a teacher. She graduated from Holmes High School in Covington last year. As for Brockman, he is a canine deputy, and he uh, started with the Sheriff's Department in 2010. He's been placed on administrative leave during this investigation, which is typical protocol during officer-involved shootings. Amy Wattis, Night on Your Side, live from Boone County. Thank you, Amy. Boone County Sheriff Michael Helmick has ordered a full investigation into this shooting. We're told an autopsy will take place sometime over this weekend. Not on your side is staying on top of the investigation. We will report new information as we get it on air and on WCPO.com. Investigators.